Nairobi County. To be precise, the governor and his executive have been uh, have been faithfully attending uh, both Senate and County Assemblies. And in fact, this financial year alone, the governor has been to the Senate more than 11 times. And we are sure he will go there uh, to respond to any issues that have been raised by the Senate. And number two, we understand that many people are not happy at the progress being made. And this is why we've seen and heard noise uh, come after his nation uh, state of the county address, where the governor eloquently outlined the progress over his last 19 months in office. And uh, just to uh, bring to attention that a lot of challenges are inherited, just like the audits uh, in question, but his Excellency the Governor is up to the task to take them on. And challenges and achievements walk hand in hand. And what we've seen is a, a sensationalizing of oversight, politicizing of oversight, and we wonder why the undue focus on Nairobi alone. We've seen the Governor being uh, uh, responding to uh, the Senate, just like I've mentioned earlier, more than 10 times he's been there. We've seen other governors, uh, or rather we've not seen other governors being summoned to the <laughs> Senate. Uh, we've not seen uh, the governor of Kisumu, uh, Anyang Nyongo, being summoned to the Senate. We've not seen uh, Orengo being summoned to the Senate, among other governors. So our question is, why just the undue focus in Nairobi. Is it premature politics being played? And we've also seen other political leaders, together with uh, some media stations, misrepresenting facts from the audit report. Just recently, we saw uh, the K24, uh, the news anchor, uh, misrepresenting the amount uh, in question about legal uh, bills, where he mentioned that the county government of Nairobi has paid 10 billion in uh, the, the year in question, whereas uh, the audit report clearly stipulates that it is the uh, 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 the pending bills uh, in legal fees that are in question amounting to 10 billion, and not the amount paid. I can confirm that the amount paid uh, within the, uh, the year in question for legal fees are around 287 million. So we wonder where do they get this uh, news from and why can they just report uh, facts and not just hearsay. Also, uh, mind you, the 